get a makeover. I would love to get five people. I can She said, who would get the makeover? Yeah, at least two or three. Uh, I'm telling you, what? Yeah. I guess she's going to do that number on the end, I think. <laughs> I think that's the way she did Okay, what are you doing? Uh, yeah. 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 Ruth, 
Two, Yeah, we're learning at 
It's not gonna. Uh, yes, we want to uh, respect her. She has come out. She has worked all day. And she has come out. She's been doing and hair. Be and and that is a very hard task, a job that I would never want to have. To do people hair, hair, to make them beautiful. Because if you don't make them look the way they want to look, then they get mad at you. <laughs> And I don't want that job. That's too. That's too rough for me. Watch it. And then um, it's time to pay. They don't want to pay. Uh, they wanted uh, a five. Uh, they wanted uh, a twenty inch, but they only had enough for five inches. Mm. Long. Come on, let's just keep it real, ladies. We're just having fun tonight. Okay, we would like to present and introduce to some. My friend, Mrs. Campbell, all the way from Kansas City, Missouri. Good afternoon, good afternoon, thank you. Good afternoon. I, want to, I would like to introduce myself tonight. My name is Rashana Campbell. I am, how are you? I'm wonderful. Um, I am, uh, I'm just going to give you a bio of me. I am a you know, a wife first. Uh, I have been married for 11 years. Uh, I met my husband in high school. I worked at Lady Foot Locker and he worked at Foot Locker. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
issues and colors. However, that can be different things in your life. And then you say to yourself a lot of times, just like Ms. Kim said earlier, we say to ourselves a lot of different things. We make statements to ourselves and we don't share them with other people. And sometimes you just get confused about who you are, what you want to be, how you, how you would like to dress, um, what you would like to look like, um, uh, what career you would like to take up. Um, so those are the type of things that <coughs> the decisions you have to make as you progress in life. So I did that, uh, oh, decided gosh. that I wanted to be a hairdresser, <laughs> left all the jobs alone, pursued that, opened up my first salon at 21. To do that, I work, 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 work. And all my friends, party, 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 party. But I had my eye on the prize. I knew since I made this decision, remember what I what did I want to be? A lawyer. Right. I knew if I made this turn that I had to become successful, whatever choice I decided. Okay, I was very conscious of that. And then, of course, along the way, you feel like you're going to disappoint your parents. So I had to make them feel good about me. So I'm like, okay, I'm not going to go to school to become a lawyer. However, I am going to open up a salon. I'm going to be this fabulous hairdresser. And it's going to be this, it's going to be that. I'm going to have all these people working for me. And it's going to be like the salon <coughs> that you see on TV. Yeah. Right? So I um, decided that, and of course, my parents held me to it because they had a plan already for me. Again, 21, I opened up my first salon, so I was able to do that, and I was proud of it. Worked there, and then my journey in life started even with my marriage and everything else that was to come. However, um, I had a salon in Lee Summit for the last five years. It was phenomenal. Um, we spent a lot of money getting that baby designed. Yes. We truly got it out. It was beautiful. And that's because I wanted my ladies to come in. And I say, my ladies, once you make an appointment with me, you're not late. <laughs> and so I wanted my ladies to feel beautiful walking in. And of course, I was going to make them feel beautiful walking out. So um, Kim was in my chair, and she and I were talking. And she said, you know what? Because we were talking about repositioning. She said, you know what? I want you to come to my conference. And you know, I have one once a year. And um, I would love to, to you for you to speak to my young ladies. So I said, speak. Conference? Really? Me? OK, sure. And just like she said, coming out of your comfort zone. There are times that people might ask, may ask you to do things that you're not comfortable with doing in a positive manner. And sometimes you have to jump out there and just take that leap. However, what you gain is more experience along the way, and you feel more confidence in yourself. So with that, I accepted this with honor today, and I uh, truly appreciate you um, for inviting me. And um, we're talking about repositioning. I would like to ask this question today, because I deal with a lot of women that sit in my chair. And believe it or not, the most beautiful women are the most, they're the most insecure. And it's, it's crazy. And then the women that you think are not secure and confident, they are. It's just like, really? It's like the opposite. And so there are a lot of times I have the, that I have a client sitting in my chair, and I have to tell her how beautiful she is. And it's not always just about the outer. Yes, yes, yes. yes. that's right. Most of the time I have to say, you are amazing. Did you know that you were funny? I love the way that you laugh. Um, I have to say to this woman that um, she is very loyal, depending on what conversation she's talking about. But you are a loyal being. You are a uh, uh, charismatic person. You are a sophisticated lady. You are a lady that is full of life. People love to be around you. You are giving. These are all the type of things that I have to read into a person sitting in touch with you. Because not all the times you feel that way about yourself. So with that being said, let's name three women that are beautiful to you. If anyone can raise their hand, but please raise your hand. And let's discuss those three beautiful women. Go ahead. My mom. Your mom, your mommy. Okay. And what do you? What is beautiful about your mind? Her 
God in her that just shines and it makes her look magnificent. So let's talk about our appearance. It's beautiful that you guys know it and their aesthetic beauty is just showing. What's beautiful about her? Her personality is she's funny. She is too, you are So April's beautiful. Two people. Your mom. And Toya, okay, you have to tell me why. Both of them. Is everything about them, any particular thing about them? Well, she has pretty teeth. <laughs> <laughs> I love teeth. I love your smile. What else? What about your mom? I saw your mom, she has, a, she has a big personality. So she has a big personality. <laughs> <laughs> She's fun to hang out with. Yeah, not all mommies are hard, so that's a good trait. What about you? My aunt. Your aunt. Aww. Who's your aunt? Right <laughs> there. What's beautiful about your aunt? How lovely she is. How lovely she is. Thank you for being lovely, Auntie. We need more love in this world. Thank you for being my Auntie. I'm going to say uh, my mother and your mother-in-law. And, mother and your mother-in-law. Yes. Mm -hmm. And why? Uh, my mother, because she is the best mother in the world. She has supported me in everything that I have done. You are bad. <laughs> and my sister don't have to get jealous. <laughs> <laughs> and she always tell everyone that I was a perfect kid. Yeah. Um, my mother-in-law, because I know she got my back, even when she don't want to. <laughs> Man. <laughs> and the yes. support, both you guys and I know I live next door, and Miss Kim has her hands in a lot. So, of course, you guys support her as you that's how you're able to do all that you get. Yeah. Okay, so any what, what about out? So we talk we're talking a lot about inner. What about out? Outward appearance. Because that's when you look at people, you judge them. You say, yeah, oh, most people do. We are outward appearance. Um, and if it is still your mom, then tell me what it is about your mom. Oh, it's no, about no, our it's making good. <laughs> making good. And what is about making good that you like? <laughs> you like her taste in fashion, okay? We'll do two more and then we'll move on. I would say uh, Miss Campbell, you, yeah. oh, Anna. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. I think that you are a very beautiful person outside of in. And I love your hairstyle. Yeah. Your short hair is just really cool. It's cute. I everything out together. So what she's saying, I usually wear my hair short, and then I decided to get 20 inches yesterday. So, <laughs> so thank you so much. Okay, uh, is there one more person that we can add to the list? <coughs> one more person. My aunt. Your aunt. Uh-uh. Uh, So with that being said, Miss Simone. Oh, Simone is gorgeous. What do you? What is? What's beautiful about her? 
It's captivating. You should see her mom. Yeah, back at her. Okay, this is the last one. Pastor Iris. You're Pastor Iris. Yeah. She's so pretty. Is she? When she carries herself, she likes to be in high. Oh. Okay. So your auntie, your pastor. Okay, so with that being said, there again, let's wrap it back around the inner and the outer beauty. And I like to say, and I say this to myself every day when I get up in the morning and I put on makeup, make sure my hair is done, I'm picking out my outfit. And uh, of course, you're brushing your teeth and you're doing your little eyes and ends to make sure that you are complete before you go out, before you leave the house. However, that inside <coughs> you has to be right as well. So let's name some traits of a beautiful person. And let's just throw them out here. Name it. A beautiful person is what? Just some traits and characteristics. You don't know? Okay. So how can we rephrase that? Someone that you can talk to and be yourself around. Trust. Trustworthy. Non-judgmental. They came from somewhere in the room. We appreciate that. Trust. Someone that you can trust. Mm -hmm. Say it again, babe. Someone who is thoughtful and kind. Definitely. A person with a good personality. Yeah. Personality-wise, you know. Charming, yes. uplifting, yes. smiling all the time. Right. They all try to be somebody else. Right. That understands who they are and they're not trying to pretend to be someone else. With that being said, I want you to take a moment and think about three things that are beautiful about yourself. Okay? And a lot of times we think about the things that are beautiful, we think about the things we would like to change. Mm -hmm. If I had $10,000, <laughs> right? And I, that's a dream board. Today, just thinking about all the characteristics that you have, I would like for everyone to take 30 seconds and to think about three things that make you beautiful. Okay? So we'll go ahead and we're going to count down. 30. I want you to think because I'm going to call on you, okay? So we're at 18 seconds, 15 seconds, we're at 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, Miss Kim. Name one thing that's beautiful about you. Uh, I love my smile. <laughs> <laughs> we love your smile too. <laughs> 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 no. Maddie, tell me one thing that's beautiful about you. She wouldn't even No, my eyes. Your eyes. And you know what? I want you to feel comfortable about seeing beautiful yeah. things about yourself. It's all right. If you don't, who else will? Yes. It is okay to say something yeah. nice about yourself. Maddie, you do have beautiful eyes. What about you? I would say my eyes, too. Your eyes, too? So you know how to use them, how to get what you want? What about you? I'm you, Okay. You understand who you are. I love that. Uh-huh. You're artistic? That's a, that's a beautiful thing. Some people are mm -hmm. creative. Uh -huh. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> So you're fun to be around. <laughs> you're fun to be around? Yeah. Okay. That's what I hear. The personality? The personality? What about the personality? Yeah. You like this? <laughs> so you're fun to be around. This is double trouble. Yes. Okay. Yes. How about you? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Being kind. 
And if I hurt somebody feeling I feel, I mean, if I hurt, I think I hurt someone I feel, it makes me feel better. <laughs> <laughs> so you're in tune with other people. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So sensitive. Yeah. 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 We need you out here. What about you? <laughs> a giver and compassion. Yeah. <laughs> you're a giver? Compassionate. A compassionate giver. Mm -hmm. From the heart. Okay, so you're always thinking about someone else. Okay. Love it. <laughs> I am a compassionate and a giver also, and I love my full finger. Oh. I'm a loyal person. You are loyal. I'm weird. <laughs> and I attract weird people, so we. Okay, yeah, now vibe. The beautiful thing about you, though. Uh, um, um, my. Yeah, well, eyes. Your eyes. Yeah. What color are they? Yeah. Depending on the time of day. They change. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, same uh, my heart. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you're a giver too? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so you guys, we, we see the givers in the room. Hang out with them. Okay, what about you in the back? Lady in the back with the green on? There's two of them, one That's in the two. back row. Yeah. 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 
Your smile. Yeah. Come on, Kay, look at Kay, what you're saying. Yeah, just say one of them, babe. Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I like my skin color. Beautiful. So we have two. What's skin? Um, what did I say? <laughs> oh, I still look young. <laughs> 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 so we have three. <laughs> Be the best version of yourself. Okay? 
All right. And I would like to say thank you for allowing me to come out tonight, Kim. I really appreciate you and I honor the fact that you invited me. I really had a What's wonderful time. Person? And um, let's change and let's be a better person tomorrow, okay? Yes. Have a wonderful evening. <laughs>
there remembering something positive. Amen. So we're going to get ready to close out on tonight. And we're going to have someone from New Beginning Worship Center to come and close us out. Uh, Elder Chantel Hall, please. <laughs>